Hello there, I'm your host Dan Rojas and this is a 45 watt solar panel kit that I put together this weekend. It took me about 20 minutes to do. This kit I bought off of eBay for $230. It's pretty much the same system that you're going to get from Harbor Freight for about the same price. This system again produces 45 watts. It consists of three 15 watt solar panels that are all tied together at the power controller. Now, the nice thing about this system is that it contains everything that you need to do a solar project. It has the regulator to charge batteries. It also comes with two compact fluorescent bulbs, some really neat connectors, and the whole system can run the lights and charge some batteries. It's not a real powerful system, but it is a nice start to get you familiarized with the solar process. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take you around the backside. I'm going to show you some of the connectors to this, and in a future video, I'm going to show you how you can link a couple of these together to start getting some real power. This system comes with its own voltage meter built into it, and it has these compact fluorescent bulbs, which are 12 volt and they're five watts a piece. They have this uh, like uh, speaker jack attachment, and they just basically plug in, and you can see that the lights. You can run two lights at one time. They're being powered totally by the solar panel. And you also have these battery leads over here. We're going to see if it can run this 12-volt uh, motor from an RV fan. This, this motor pulls a lot, so we'll see what happens. You can watch it draw down the lights. Wow. Feels good. That's actually pretty strong. That's completely off of the sun right now. Let's see if it'll do a drill motor. Now this is totally off the solar panel. So we're gonna hook this up. You can see it pulls the whole system down and then you got to just give the motor a little bit of get it going. That's pretty cool. put this solar panel to action and see if we can get it to do some work. So we're sanding a piece of wood. And just a solar panel, not a bad deal. The way a system like this would work for your house is you take a 12 volt battery like this one. This, uh, you'd preferably want a deep cycle battery. What you would do is you would take your uh, negative and positive and attach them to the right spots. And you're going to notice that this system will start to draw some current. Now this battery is pretty much fully charged. It's been, uh, but if this was a lower battery, if this battery was weaker, you'd see the voltage in this drop. So this is going to trickle charge this throughout the day and at the end of the day you can take an inverter like this one. Now the battery and the inverter didn't come with the kit, but you could take an inverter. This is a 750 watt inverter. This converts the 12 volt direct current into alternating current that you can use. This battery is charging up. It's worth noting that this, is a, this 45 watt system is the equivalent of about 4.5 amps at 12 volts. So it's going to take approximately eight to ten hours to charge top off one of these batteries and you're probably going to get about an hour to an hour and a half at three to four hundred watts of, of usage. You would need several of these obvious to, obviously to do each individual task in your house and that's why people who are totally off the grid with solar have several racks of these and their roof is covered with those. So in a future video I'm going to show you how to tile these together so you can take two or three or four systems like this, put them together to get more usable power. And I'm also gonna be showing you how linking these together in different ways can change the voltage and the amperage. I'm your host, Dan Rojas. Thank you for watching and enjoy our videos.